Now, the Batman and Robin match wits with the Riddler in a game where the stakes are life itself. If music be the food of death. One sunny day in April, Dick Grayson, home from college for spring vacation, strolls in Gotham City's famous Center Park. Glancing up, he sees a small airplane overhead, skywriting, tracing a strange message in the sky. Gee, what does that say? Young man, can you make out what that plane is writing? I think so, but it doesn't make any sense. What makes the car go? Is that what it says? That's what it says. How odd. It, it sounds like a, a riddle. Sure does. Hey, a riddle. Wow. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Well, uh, uh, goodbye. He must be a track star. I never saw anyone run that fast. A very short time later, a door flies open in the study of Bruce Wayne. Batman! Dick, what's wrong? Not Dick, not now. Time for Robin and Batman. Oh? The Riddler! Where? I saw a riddle in the sky, a plane skywriting. Trying to reach me? Sure. W wants to give you a clue, as usual, to what he's going to do. So, he's loose again. The dope? Won't he ever learn? Don't underestimate him, Robin. He's a brilliant criminal. What was the riddle? What makes the car go? What makes the car go? That's not a riddle. Not a whole one. I know. There's just one answer. Gasoline. But it doesn't make sense. Gasoline. Of course. Hmm? After quick preparations, the dynamic duo, Batman and Robin, peer through masks at Gotham City, slipping away beneath them as they soar in the Batcopter over Gotham Harbor, headed out to sea. Where are we going, Batman? To meet a ship. A ship? A huge tanker, due to arrive today from the Middle East. Remember the question, what makes the car go? The ship's cargo is gasoline. A cargo as precious as gold anywhere in the world. Wow! You think the Riddler would try to steal a ship? Why not? The bigger the better, it's just his style. We're almost there. Look, on the horizon. Isn't that a tanker? That's it! Now look for a smaller craft. Oh. Batman, behind us, a plane. They're shooting at us. And hitting us. The motor is skipping. We're losing control. Its power gone, the Batcopter sinks toward the water. Then... Just offshore, the Batman spies a small, deserted island, not much more than a sandbar. Skillfully, he steers the copter there and lets it settle. As they climb from their disabled craft, the Batman and Robin see the Riddler. He's in a powerboat in the water and speaks to them through a bullhorn. <laughs> Thank you, Batman, for falling into my crack. <laughs> Obliging. And you, Robin, how nice to destroy you both at once. <laughs> oh, I'm not interested in gasoline. No, I'm going to steal something else, far more valuable, with you out of the way. The island you are on is mined with explosives, set to go off in five minutes. <laughs> if, if you approach the water to escape anywhere but one place, you will cut off a mine. The one place not mined is the little pier. You see it? With the escape boat tied up? Huh? Huh? Yes? No, no, don't run for it, no. The boat is booby-trapped, too. <laughs> well, however, I'm always fair. You can deactivate the bomb in the boat and escape if you solve the riddle there. Goodbye forever, Batman! <laughs> The 
Batman and Robin race to the pier and find a metal box with wires leading from it to explosives in the boat. On the box are seven levers, labeled with the letters A through G. And below the levers, a sign with the riddle, What letter is like an escape? Very funny. Don't talk, think. We have to pull the lever with the letter that answers the riddle. Hmm, a letter like an escape. We, we have two minutes. Think. Wait, I think I have it. What if you don't? We die a little earlier. Here goes nothing. Or everything. Hey, nothing happened. You did it. How? Don't talk. Let's go. Quickly, they untie the boat, rev the motor, and race away. The whole island, right up in the air. The Riddler never kids around. How did you know the letter was G? How is G like an escape? Because G makes one gone. Oh. Look for the next riddle. It should be in the boat. Oh, all right. He couldn't help leaving a clue for us if we escape, could he? Right, sure. Right here in the toolkit. A note to Batman. What does it say? Not one, but two riddles. Here's the first. When does pulling a bowstring draw crowds instead of arrows? Hey, I've got it, Batman. Yes? When it's pulled by a violinist. Good, Robin, good. What's the other one? Why is a speeding train like a citizen of Moscow? Hmm. Of course, of course. What is it? They're both Russian. Commissioner Gordon here. This is the Batman, Commissioner Gordon. Batman, how are you? Listen carefully. We haven't much time. Our friend, the Riddler, will try his biggest heist tonight. The Riddler, eh? Tonight, the great Russian violinist, Igor Pashevsky, will play his first American concert. His violin is the most valuable Stradivarius in the world. The Riddler will try to steal that violin before the eyes of the world. Oh? That's what he thinks. In Gotham's boat, a huge crowd fills the entire auditorium. Some stand in the aisles, waiting for Pashevsky to appear on stage. Bruce Wayne, socialite and patron of the arts, sits in his private box with Dick Grayson. As the house lights dim, all others eagerly watch the stage. They scan the audience for a sign of the Riddler. He'll never try it. Police are everywhere, at the doors, in the wings, the dressing rooms. Here's Poshevsky. We'll soon see. smoke. He's trying to start a panic. Quick! And Bruce Wayne and Dick Grayson slip behind the curtain of their box to become the dynamic duo. None too soon. Fire! Fire! Spreads through the crowd like a plague as smoke begins to roll from the back of the auditorium. Poshevsky stops playing, confused. Your attention! What, what Your is attention, it? please! What, what is it? Up there! It's Robin! Yes, it's Robin! The crowd looks up to see Robin perched on the rail of the private box. It's just smoke, a trick. Please stay in your seats. There is no fire. But pandemonium is erupting. Nothing will hold it back. Robin, where is the Batman? There he is, on the stage with Pashevsky, the Batman. Oh. Leaving Robin to handle the crowd, Batman has sprung to the stage to protect the musician. 
Mr. Pashevsky, yeah. your violin. What is happening? A, a man with a mask. Your violin, is it safe? <laughs> oh, da, da, a policeman. I gave it to him. He, he, he came to me during the fire when it started for, for, for safekeeping. I left it with this man. A policeman. <laughs> the fat man hears the Riddler's laugh. He sees him in police uniform carrying a violin case, slipping out a side door surrounded by his thugs. Hubbard, door on the left. I'm on my way. Fighting their way through the crowd, they catch up to the last of the thugs. <laughs> but to get to the street too late. The Riddler is racing away in a car. From his window, he yells back. Too bad, Batman. One more try. <laughs> the key of A. Yes, the key of A. <laughs> Quick, Batman. The Batmobile. The key of A. It must be the answer to a riddle. We're supposed to guess the riddle. He's getting away. Let's go. Ah, oh, yes. I think I see. Can we go now? Yes. But not in the Batmobile. It's walking distance. You get Commissioner Gordon. I'll go greet the Riddler. Where? In Igor Poshevsky's hotel room. A darkened room in the Conrad Hotel. If anyone were in the room, he would see a shadow fall across the window. A hulking figure looms outside it on the fire escape. Pries the window open quietly. He carries a violin case. Steps softly into the room. A man in a strange costume, covered with question marks. Then, from the dark, he hears a voice. Good evening, Mr. Enigma. You kept me waiting just to change your clothes. You must want to be caught a lot. Your riddle was easy. I read the papers, too. Oh. You won't catch me, you, you, you human rodent. <laughs> I read all the interviews with Poshevsky. Here's your riddle question. What key unlocks the door to Poshevsky, right? That led me to this door. That lot is going to do you. That lot. That... Your answer, the key of A, is the key to Poshevsky because his favorite concerto, which he wrote himself, is written in that key. <laughs> Head of the class, that man. Now I'm going to. <sighs> Don't go to sleep, Riddler. We have company. The door opens. Lights go on. Robin and Commissioner Gordon are in the room. Hey, it's him. You got him. And there's the violin. Why in heaven's name did he bring it here? Now, Commissioner, where is the last place we would all think to look? Hmm. I... He planned to hide it here, under Pashevsky's nose, then come back at a later date. I see. I see. Very clever. But you figured it out. How, Batman? What was the riddle? For once today, Robin, we're not in a rush. You have plenty of time to figure it out. <laughs> oh, <Batman. laughs>